so Purdue is coming into tonight's contest looking for a little bit of revenge and it's not going to be easy as we can see Indiana is in it to win it right here they have these posters and it's going to be a very difficult game for the Boilermakers and coach Morin said it best herself she said hey we're well versed with Purdue playing them amps us up but what gets them going even more is being able to play at home and as we can see it's pretty lucky that the Hoosiers get to play here inside Assembly Hall tonight back to you guys Thanks, guys. So Jalen Penn has built herself quite a resume this season. Named to the all-freshman team, not to mention she had her career high of 25 points in that first game in the WNIT. And tonight she's been such a key player for the Hoosiers. Already has nine points and shooting 67% from the field. Hopefully she can keep it up because that's the momentum Indiana really needs to take a win tonight. Back to you guys. Coach, you guys did a good job hanging on there. What's going to be a key to coming back and taking that lead in the second half? we got to make layups. We've had inside shots with our five, our post players, and they've got to be able to make those shots. Otherwise, we'd be probably tied right now. Uh, but we're playing good basketball right now, but th that's going to be the big key. Odin and McLaughlin have been doing so well getting your points up offensively, but who else do you really want to come out and shine to get those extra points that you need on the board? Well, it's Ariana Harris. She's like 0 for 9, and she's the one who's got to make those shots. She's not, not shooting an outside shot, but those layups she's got to have for her team. All right, thanks, Coach. Back to you guys. Ariana Harris, Purdue, and the Big Ten's Big Ten Defensive Player of the Year, and we've definitely seen her do some great things on the defensive side. Seven rebounds, three blocks, but we have not seen her perform well offensively. And Coach Versep was the first person to call her out. Right now, she's 0 and 9 for her shots, and she really wants to get some points and be that third player Versep was talking about, so that Purdue can come and take the lead and take a win in the WNIT. Back to you guys. Thanks, guys. I think it's fair to say that if there's a record out there, then Tyra Buss is going to try to break it. Right now, she's just two away from grabbing 200 three-pointers, which puts her six down from the all-time record at Indiana. But not to mention, you take away all the records, she's just such a fantastic player for this program. We see her play both sides of the ball. She has, you know, 19 points right now. We saw her grab that absolutely great charge. There's nothing that Tyra can't do, and, you know, she's going to take this team hopefully to victory tonight. 